Hello everybody, I'm about to board a plane to Los Angeles to the YouTube convention known as VidCon. This will be my fifth one, except I don't know anyone that's gonna be on my plane, so I hope I'll make friends. Let's go. Despite the fact that I have no one here urging me to get here sooner, I think I'm gonna be two hours early for my plane. That never happened. You know, I only took four days off to take this holiday to Los Angeles, which is the shortest amount of time I've ever spent. I'm seeing friends in Venice Beach on Twitter and stuff, and it's mainly open. You know, this LA is one of my favorite places in the world and it makes me really sad that I can't stay out there for longer. So, I definitely need to make sure I always have at least a week there from now on. The worst part about Guy Wick Airport is the fact that the Wi-Fi never works and there's no signal, so literally you just can't do anything, especially when you're alone. This is my second most recent trip to America from Gatwick, and the second time I've been randomly checked. I turn on all my electronic devices, take my shoes off. Gatwick. So I got to switch my seat to the upper deck, so this will be interesting. I've never sat on that kind of a deck of a virgin flight before. So I've now arrived in Las Vegas and I only have a short one hour layover before LAX, I'm on my way. I love the airport in Vegas because there's a little strip outside you get to walk from place to place because it's so freaking hot and it reminds me of last year when I went to uh, VidCon with Dodie and I kind of miss her at this point because I had a very lonely flight. I watched some movies, I listened to a lot of music, I edited an entire video, I was very productive and I even got a little nap in. And they gave me two wines which was more than enough for me to go <laughs> Usually when I head up to LA, I get a big blue bus, which costs me like a dollar, and I go straight to Santa Monica, but the sun is setting. I've got about an hour left, so I've ordered an Uber, and hopefully I can catch the sunset right in time to get that shot. So in the end, I'm really glad I got that bus, because I just caught the sunset right at the end of it. So now I can just get a quick time lapse, stay here for a bit, watch the lights come up, and then back to Anaheim. So I seem to have a common theme amongst my travel vlogs recently, which is getting injured. The only injury I've suffered from this trip so far is getting some sand in my new leather shoes and causing so much friction that my feet want to fall off because I had to run through to get that shot. And also an injury to my wallet because it was quite expensive to get here and it's going to be expensive to get back, but it's just so worth it in my opinion. If you've ever been to Los Angeles and you haven't been to Santa Monica Beach for sunset, just do it. You are missing a lot. Now arrived at the convention center, hi. and what's your name? Victoria. Victoria is the first person to say hi to me. So hi, hi Victoria. Hi. Um, everyone is getting food at the Cheese Day Factory right now without me, rude. So I have to go check on my luggage and wait. So yeah, it's Katie. Hey. Oh my God, from the original videos. I know, right? Long time ago. Um, I've just been wandering, sitting by myself for the last hour. Really? I've, I've been <laughs> in downtown Disney all by myself. We were meant for each other. My friend Melanie. in the room. So I finally made it back to my room and I just realized I got my name badge here and I don't know what's right for my passion so if you could tell me what I should put there I'll do it. Anyway thanks for watching my first VidCon vlog. Tomorrow's will be even more fun. I'll see you then. Goodbye. Hey! Oh hey! How are you? I'm great. <laughs> We're good. That this happened.